Hi friends, let's study a new topic. How can we write an assembly language program to sort the numbers in ascending order? Here we consider four numbers 9, 3, 7, 2. We are using bubble sort method to sort the numbers to make the sorted ascending order orderly sorter okay in bubble sort we are uh, the method using is first taking the first two numbers and uh, check for which is the uh, less lesser one if the first one is lesser we don't uh, don't have to do anything else we have to swap the numbers then we go for the next two numbers and uh, checking which is less if the first one is less we don't uh, don't have to do anything else we have to swap the numbers and continuous for uh, till uh, continuous till reach the last value okay let's consider uh, first we take the first two numbers 9 and 3 by taking 9 and 3 we can see that 3 is less than 9 so we have to swap the numbers by swapping the 3 will reach at the first so the array will be become 3 9 7 2 okay now we have to check the next two numbers that is 9 and 7 we can see that 7 is less than 9 so we have to show these two numbers by swapping 7 and 9 we will get the array 3 7 9 Okay, and now we have to check these last two numbers 9 and 2. By checking 9 and 2, we can see that 2 is less than 9, and we have to swap the numbers. Then we will get the array as 3, 7. 2, 9 this whole thing we can take as a loop this is our main loop first loop by the end of first loop we will get the largest number at the end of the array here is 9 we can see that the largest number of this array is 9 and we have got that 9 at the last position in the end of first loop here we can see that here is uh, four numbers the inner loop that means uh, the by the ch uh, checking of uh, two numbers we have taken is first here these two numbers then second these two numbers and third these two numbers we have to see that uh, we can see that here is four numbers hence we have the inner loop only three that means total number of uh, values in the array minus one will be the starting of our inner loop that means there is four numbers we have to take only three loop in the inner in the second main loop this all this whole we can take as a loop Hence, this is our first loop and in second loop we will start from this array that is 3 7 2 9 here in this uh, inner loop we have go for 3 loop that is first 9 and 3 then 9 and 7 that is first to second 
the second, third, third, fourth. Here we can see that uh, nine is the our uh, nine is our largest number, and which is came at the last position. So we don't have to do anything with this with this number. So here the inner loop will check only for the first two numbers and second two numbers. Okay, let's start by taking the first two numbers. We can see that this is already in the sorted manner. That is, first number is less than the second number. So we do not have to do anything. Three, seven, two, nine. Next, we have to take the next two numbers, seven and two. By taking seven and two, we can see that two is less than seven, and so we have to swap these two numbers. Then we will get the array in the format three. Two, seven, nine. This is the end of second loop. Here we can uh, see that uh, the second largest number of this array is came at the second last position. Okay. Now we can we have only one in the in the loop to check. That is in the third loop. At the starting of third loop, we will have the array in the form 3, 2, 7, 9. We have to check only for only these two numbers. And we can see that by checking which is less, 2 is less than 3. That is the second number is less than the first number. So we have to solve the numbers in the position first and second. Then we will get two, three, seven, nine. This is the answer, and which is the end of our third loop. By the end of third loop, we will get the numbers sorted. This is only because here is only four numbers, so four minus one. 3 will be our uh, total loops in the main window. We have 3 main loops. Uh, that is the number of inner loop in the first loop. And uh, as the main loop proceeds, the uh, number of inner loops will be decreased. Okay. Here in uh, our program, we are going to take the main loop as in the register main loop in the register r0 and in a loop in the register r1 or r2 we have we can take uh, anything uh, here i am using uh, r2 let's see the kill programming by starting org 000h we can say with any name i am giving SORT underscore ASC dot ASM. ASM stands for assembly language program. Uh, ASM is the extension for the assembly language program. Save. Next. So we have to give the uh, length of the array. It is how many uh, numbers are there in the array to sort which is uh, we are taking from 2000H 2000H for that we are giving the value to the dptr move dptr comma hash 2000H next we are taking the value in the location 2000 to the accumulator for that move x comma sorry move x a comma at dptr then we have to load the accumulator value to the registers r0 and r2 r0 is our main loop r2 is our inner loop okay here we can see that here is four numbers and we need only three loops by taking loading this value we will get we will have 
4 uh, to make it 3 we have to give a decrement decrement a yeah. then move r0 comma a move r2 comma a okay here shall start the first loop move dptr comma we are loading the next location to the dptr dptr comma hash 2017 h we can give any location i am giving here 2017 then move a comma r2 this is for as the loop forwards we have to load the value r2 to the r0 or vice versa for that we are using this charge move a comma r2 and uh, move Now to move a comma r2 we have to load a move r0 value move a comma r0 and move r2 comma r0 sorry yeah our final aim is taking the value of r0 to uh, r0 to r2 for that we are moving first the value in the r0 to a and then a to r2 Next, we can load the values. So we will give the next loop variable, loop label, move x a comma at dptr. Then move that value to b, move b comma a. Then increment dptr for taking the value uh, dpdr position to the next location then again loading the value move x a comma at dpdr now we can subtract for that we are using the keyword subb a comma b the result will, the result of the subtraction will be at the accumulator hence uh, the value in the accumulator will be changed in short we check for if there is carry or no carry if there is carry means this is not for jump if no carry if there is no carry we have to move to the level y by else we can we have to swap the numbers for that uh, we have to load the initial value uh, in the array position to a for that move x a comma at dptr and this is because here in the subtraction the value of accumulator will be changed then exchange the values for that the code is xch a comma b then we have to place these two values to the new positions for that we will give move x at dptr comma a and uh, we have to give the pre uh, b value to the previous location for that we have to decrement the memory for decrementing the <coughs> memory we are decrementing dptr for decrementing dptr we are use decrement dc dptr then 
we will move the b value to the accumulator for that move a comma b and then moving the value to that location move x by td p t r comma a then increment d p t r to move the d p t r location to the next position then y by dj nz r2 comma xx this is the inner loop and uh, in the main loop we have to go dj nz r0 comma z z this is nothing but uh, decrementing and jump if down zero that means we will give a decrement to r2 and if it become zero this loop will close else go to the position level xx if the value of r2 is non zero then go to the level xx okay here the same thing decrementing the value of r0 and if it is not reached the zero value then we'll jump to the is that is that variable then the end this is the program we have to save it then add to the source group for which double click the source group the name of our program is sort underscore asc dot asm added close then we have to translate it it's zero error and zero warnings now build now then rebuild then we have to run for running we will click uh, start bus stop debug session under the menu debug okay by clicking here we will see that uh, 2014-2028 give some uh, some change 207 have to change uh, change the value of 207 to 2014 4 this is only for seeing in a smooth way no need for changing it if we know the position and we can give uh, the data in any place uh, repeating the steps then debug start bus stop a debug session we have to give the count in the location 2000 let's check please four numbers four then at 2014 <coughs> nine three seven two now run by running we have got a uh, two three seven nine it is sorted in the ascending order let's give another number six we will give eight five four one ten and uh, two two okay two six numbers one two three four five six okay. now reset and then turn again we have got one two four five eight ten this is in the ascending order okay thank you